What's good with y'all, man? This is Matt Key, I Slap TV, feel me? We in the building right now. Well, not in the building, we outside, feel me? We here with the Tycoon. It's the Tycoon of the building, man. Y'all watching I Slap TV, man. We out here, man. Frisco, man. Daddy City to be exact, you know what I'm saying? But it's Frisco, though, right? I'm just saying. You feel me? Small things to a giant, you know what I'm saying? Look out for my CD. Back to the Blacktop compilation. It'll be on iTunes, you know what I'm saying? And in stores. This summer, this July, actually, you know what I mean? Um, and I mean, shit, Google me. We got all kind of stuff going on, man. I just opened up my website, tycoon.com. And, you know, like I said, it's bigger than life. You know what I mean? So, what's good? What you got popping with you right now? I mean, well, you know what I'm saying? I'm signed to Mercenary Entertainment, you know what I mean? Out of Sacramento with the rapper Hollow Tip, you know, 80 West, the Mercenaries, my boy Nicotine, Mr. Black. We got a lot of stuff going on out there. Um, so I've been really, you know what I mean, featured on different projects that we're releasing out there throughout the year. I do have a solo album that's to be released under that label next year. But as of right now, down here in the, in the Bay, you know what I mean, I'm on Big War Records, you know what I'm saying, and under Big War Records, I got two projects dropping, like I said, back to the Blacktop compilation, and um, Get On Your Grind, the album, you know what I mean. And basically, those will be out this summer and this fall of 2009. In addition to that, under my own company, Alpha Gunner Multimedia, I'm putting out a documentary entitled Making Moves, you know what I mean? It features Method Man, uh, Mr. Fab, Raekwon, um, you know, Hollow Tip, JT the Bigger Figure. Um, I mean, you name it, it got everybody on there, you know what I mean? From the underground to the mainstream, you know what I'm saying? And uh, other than that, like I said, man, you know, just pushing and promoting, you know what I mean? Um, but yeah, you gotta stay tuned, we got a lot of stuff in the works. So, uh, how'd you get started in this rap game? Well, um, world. I mean, basically, you know what I'm saying. Um, I'm 26, you know what I mean. So I've been, I've been out here in the streets, you know what I mean, gritting and grinding. And basically, I started rapping at around like 12 years old, you know what I'm saying. And you know, walking around, you know, right here, like we is out in the street, you know what I mean. Basically, you know, be freestyling with different cats, you know what I mean. A lot of people was like, yo, you know, you got a little talent, you know what I mean. And at first, I didn't take it serious. You know, then I started really taking it seriously, you know, and I got a couple different opportunities, you know what I mean, to do a few shows. And, um, excuse me, basically, you know, I was given the opportunity to record in the studio, you know what I mean, with different artists, you know what I'm saying, and that's basically what put me in a position to go ahead and release my own mixtape and to further my career, and, you know what I mean. That's been, what, four or five years from now, you know what I'm saying? And uh, since then, you know, like I said, it's all been going good. I can't really complain, you know what I mean? But uh, like I said, this is the Bay Area, you know what I mean? Everybody know everybody. We all in everybody's backyard, you know what I'm saying? So, I mean, we didn't cross paths one way or another, you know what I mean? I got a face that ain't hard to forget, you know what I'm saying? So, I mean, you know, like I said, you know, just out here really just handling business, you know what I'm saying? Um, but then, like I said, Basically, you know, it allowed me to go ahead and uh, work with some, I, I don't want to say necessarily just popular or big name artists, but I'll say it's some established artists, you know, and that helped me to mold my career into the, you know, the way it is now. As far as my influences go, you know, I really, I admire anybody, you know, that's on top of their game right now, you know what I mean? Um, nobody in particular, you know, but I, I follow everybody, you know what I mean? I grew up on hip hop, you know what I mean? And I grew up on the music industry also, so I've watched different people go through their ups and downs, you know what I mean? And um, basically, you know, I, I looked at what they did that worked and what they did that didn't work, and, and you know, it, it kind of gives me the motivation to keep going, and at the same time, to, you know, um, not restrict myself, you know what I mean? To really allow myself to be creative and to see how far I can go. Because as far as, I mean, you know, history has taught us that anything basically is possible, you know? So, I mean, um, I, my influences, like I said, I look to people that are doing exactly what I'm doing, you know? That's it. So, what kind of, like, <clears throat> like, inspirational words or stuff like that do you have for the children or teenagers and everybody that's on the come up right now in this rap hip hop game? Well, I mean, well, first of all, I'm going to put it like this, man. You know, Obama said it best, man. It's time for a change. You know what I mean? It's a new millennium out here. It's a new set of rules. You know what I mean? Some of them are the same old rules, but it's a new twist on them. You know, so I'm going to basically tell you like this, you know, stay focused, stay motivated. You know what I mean? Find something that motivates you and stick with it. You know what I mean? And 
no matter what, like I said, you know, keep your head up and, and just stay focused and it'll see you through. You know what I mean? That's all I can tell you. You know, and as long as you're pushing in something in a positive direction, you always get positive results. You know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm going to tell you like this, man. Regardless, it don't matter what you do. You can be hustling. You know, you can be going to school, working a nine to five. You know, you can be rapping, you know, selling clothes, um, you know, selling vacuum cleaners. I mean, if, if you do business the right way, then, you know, if you're a good business person, you get good results. You know, when you do shady business and you try to, you know, take the easy way out or take short cuts all the time, you know what I mean, trying to get that little quick flip, you know, a lot of times you end up getting quick results, and those aren't necessarily the ones that you want, you know what I mean, same thing's happening out here in this industry right now, a lot of these cats are burning out quick. Any shout outs you got to anybody out here in the Bay, anywhere in the world? Uh, I mean, like I said, man, y'all already know, man, it's, it's Big World Records, Merch Gang, you know what I'm saying, uh, I Slap TV, you know what I mean, I Slap Entertainment, you know what I mean? Slapping cats upside the head out here, man, with beats. I'm just saying, right? Flows, you know what I mean? Photography, whatever, you know what I mean? The film, whatever you need, they got it. And we got it out here for you, man, in the Bay. That's what I'm saying, man. And that's who I give my shout out to, man. The Bay Area, the whole Bay. You see it run through my veins, you know what I'm saying? I take it with me wherever I go. I love y'all, you know what I'm saying? And I gotta give a shout out to all my friends, family, and all the fans out here that support me, you know what I mean? They keeping me hungry. You know, they keeping me focused and motivated. They supporting me and giving me the energy that I need to get out here and take this game over. You know what I mean? And that's what that's what it's about out here. And, um, you know, last but not least, man, free my little brother, man, Candyman, man. He locked up right now, you know what I'm saying? But he'll be home in a minute. And little bruh, this is for you, and I got you. It's good. You know what I'm saying? Like I said, though, it's the tycoon. Holler at me, the tycoon.com. You can Google me. I'm on the first 10 pages. You know what I mean? Or just check me out, man. Holler at Heat. I slap TV. It's good. Y'all heard that. That's I slap TV with the tycoon in the building. Feel me? And we out.